Hey guys, Amp here bringing you another Affinity Photo tutorial, and in this tutorial we will be going over the Flood Selection tool. Now, the quick select for that is just hitting the key W, and it was also on the toolbar right here, and it's a little magic wand icon. So you're going to click that, and you start off on the mode New. Now, New is just going to create a new selection anywhere you want, so you can have here, or you can come up here and select things. Now, clicking and dragging to the right is going to increase the tolerance of the flood tool. And then clicking and dragging to the left is going to decrease the tolerance. Now, over here, there's also the button contiguous, which you can select, which will change the way it selects as it will keep it all together. So that is how the tolerance is changed. But what are these other buttons? So add will allow you to add more to the selection as when you were just on new, each time you clicked and drag was a new selection. Now, the inverse of add is obviously subtract, so you can then subtract parts of it, and there is intersect, which will allow you to intersect two different selections. Now that is how you use the flood tool within Affinity Photo. Um, if you want to deselect, you can use Command D, and uh, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more Affinity Photo and Affinity Designer tutorials. Thanks for watching.